run with solar what is going on guys this is joe so in this video i'm going to go over ways to generate interest using your run with solar marketing system so what good is the system if you can't get people to actually look at the pages right so i'm going to go through exactly what you guys can do to start creating momentum literally right now and there's some things that you guys can immediately start to use while there's other things that it might take you a little while to learn and be consistent with like the online marketing and the lead generation and the blogging and guys I'll tell you this, it's not an overnight thing, especially with that. So take the time to actually learn it and stay consistent with it. But my goal as a system provider is to give you guys tools that you can use right now um, so you can earn while you learn. OK, so I'm going to I'm going to show you some things and I'm going to kind of rank these in the area, not of importance, but things that you guys can do right now. Like any of you guys can text friends and family members. And if you say, well, I don't want to do that. Just listen to what I have to say first and then you can decide if that's something that you do or don't want to do. But I highly encourage it. A lot of people tend to not want to do it because they're scared and I don't blame you uh, for being a little hesitant. But let me show you why uh, this is so much easier here. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to cover these right here. I'm going to just bang right through them. And at any point, if you guys want to pause this and stop, be sure to do that. Uh, if I'm moving too fast for you, etc. So let me start with number one texting your friends now i'm going to actually change this to warm market because there might be people that aren't necessarily your friends but um they're they're local to you or you have them in their phone contacts list or maybe you, you met them at a bar whatever the case may be you're going to want to start reaching out to people that you have in your contacts list now i'm sure a lot of you guys have literally potentially hundreds of people um in your phone contacts what i would recommend doing is when you go into your marketing system and i showed you this in the last video you go to my marketing pages and you go to lead capture the script page is at the very top if you haven't watched this training video yet and by the way this page looks a little funky right now if you're doing a screen recording don't worry about it it'll look better when you go there um, watch this training video i mean we walk you through exactly how to reach out to people in your phone contacts list and i'm telling you it's not scary uh it's not going to be awkward you're not going to annoy anyone so that's step one start working your warm market and if you want to know how to do that, just go over to this training video right here on the scripts page and watch that training. And I would say if you haven't seen it yet, pause this video right now, log into your marketing system by going to runwithsolar.info, clicking member login, log in, go to my marketing pages, lead capture and go watch the training here. All right. If you've done that, great. Get busy with doing this stuff. I'm telling you. If you send out 10 text messages a day, guys, you're going to set up appointments. You're going to get on the phone with people. You're, they're going to be interested because we have really nice videos here that do a lot of the work for you. So I encourage you to do that. That's number one. Number two, Facebook. Incredible. And, and by the way, let me tell you this. A lot of people are like, well, dude, you know, I got to spend money on paid ads and blah, blah, blah. Yes, it's good to do that, but you don't have to do that. Let me show you guys some things that are for free that you can do right now. It's just most people don't know what to do. So I'm going to give you some tips and, and, and tricks and techniques uh, to attract people to you using, attra using attraction marketing. And these things I'm going to show you that you can use on Facebook, you're going to use these same techniques on Instagram and Snapchat. And if you say, well, Joe, I'm not on them, don't worry about it. Either get on them or, you know, use it on the platforms that you're on. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and pull up my Facebook. Here it is right here. Now, here's what I'll tell you. You want to share um, either pages like this or these blog articles in your lead capture section. So my marketing pages, lead capture, you're seeing a, a screen that looks like this. These blog articles work really, really well on social media because people don't come onto Facebook to shop right they come on facebook to see what their friends are doing to socialize to maybe troll around a little bit you know whatever to have fun to read stuff to check stuff out to look at news blah 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 so these blog articles do a really nice job of that here's what you don't want to do you don't want to just grab one of these links okay we're going to grab this link and just go over here and say check it out and put a link here guys no one's going to click that I mean, like when you click that, probably not. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get a picture or something of you and make that the meat of the post. And here's why. When someone jumps on their news feed, whether it's on their phone or their computer, they're, or they have a tendency, and I'm guilty of this, and you probably are too, just scrolling through quick, right? I mean, it's like what we're conditioned to do these days on Instagram and on Facebook. You're just scrolling through stuff real quick. 
And unless something catches your eye, you're not going to stop. So you have to ask yourself, what can I post that's going to catch people's attention enough to grab their attention for a second, to make them stop scrolling? Because if you capture them with the image, you're then going to have a better chance of them checking out what you have posted in here. A couple different ways of doing this. Number one, selfies work great. Picture of your family works great. You outside, doing activities, things like that. They all work great, all right? Now, solar is a little bit of a, of a niche thing, right? So what I would recommend you do is think about some pictures that would be kind of clever. So maybe you wanna drum up a conversation about what people think about solar power being the future. So you might wanna make a post that says something like, is solar power really going to take over? What do you all think? So I might post that. I might grab a link to one of my blogs. Save the environment by switching soot to solar. Maybe I'll just grab this one just for the sake of this. Put it in here. All right, now let's get rid of this. And now I might wanna get a selfie of me, grab my phone, hold it sideways, get a selfie of me saying something like, like this. Like, what do you think, right? Or maybe I wanna write on a piece of paper, you know, in big letters, you know, taking a poll, what do you think, and pointing to it. You see what I'm doing with this though? I'm making people stop and be like, what's this dude Joe doing? And then they read my post, and then they check this stuff out. You guys gotta be creative with it, and don't worry about what people think. I mean, the magic happens when you get outside of your comfort zone. You wanna start generating interest of people who are interested in solar, do stuff like this. And there's a lot of people on your Facebook that are probably local to you. So. Be creative with that. Don't just post links, obviously. That's a really good way of doing it. So in this example, I didn't put a picture in here, but once again, I just showed you what I would do if this were me, okay? Um, and I popped a link in here. You guys can take different approaches too. You can say, hey, screw the link. I'm gonna put a picture of me and I'm gonna say something like, has anyone who lives in the southern New Jersey area put solar on their home, you know, or installed solar power on their home. Um, and maybe I put another image of me, for example. The power of this is you get people commenting like, yeah, I have, or no, I don't, I'm don't, i not sure, or ooh, I've been thinking about it. Guys, when people start commenting on your post, you can start working those leads. So if someone responded to this and said, I haven't yet, but I'm thinking about it, you think that'd be a good person to hit up? Probably, so you guys see where we're going with this. So that's extremely powerful, and it's something that you wanna focus on, is putting stuff up and asking questions that you want your prospects to answer, right? So that's another really good technique that you guys can utilize for this. Um, a couple other things, so let me go ahead and jump back over to here. And by the way, this stuff, these kind of questions, these work really well with other forms of social media. Use Instagram. Use Snapchat, like these images that you're posting on Facebook, go post the exact same thing over on Instagram and use the same description. Makes sense, right? Do the same thing with Snapchat, you know, broadcast a lot of these things. Um, the more social media channels that you can leverage with the same post, I mean, what's it take you? An extra 20 seconds to put this on Instagram too? So that's a really good way of using social media to generate interest, and that's just a couple different ideas. All right, so I challenge you to do that. Ask questions, put images up, and remember, likes and comments equal leads. Like maybe you wanna say, um, taking a poll for anyone who is interested in solar, or no, let's actually change that and say something like this. All right, so picking back up where we left off here, maybe you wanna do something like this. Taking a quick poll, who either has solar power on their home or has thought about installing it? Question mark. And then you do something like this, a feeling around activity and you do looking for and you do, there should be answers in here somewhere. Yeah. So that's a clever little post too because you know if someone comments on there and says, uh, yeah, I've been thinking about it. Guys, hit those people up. I don't, you know, if they're not local or whatever, it doesn't really matter. Hit those people up and talk with them. But there's questions like this that you can use. And if you put one up and you get no activity, don't be discouraged. Try a different approach. Get an image up there next time with it. 
But that's what I'm saying. You can always be creative with these posts. You can always put stuff up that's going to drive engagement. Likes and comments equal leads. Use social media to help you. So that'll get you started. And this section was huge just on this social media stuff. So if you need to rewatch it, rewatch it and then jot down some ideas that are flowing through your mind right now. And when you guys have ideas that come to you, write them down on your phone notepad. All right. Really powerful to think about. Let me jump back over to here. All right, so that was Facebook, and then we have Instagram and Snapchat. LinkedIn, guys, self-explanatory. Go on to LinkedIn um, and post a lot of the things that you're posting, just like on Facebook, on there too. Search out for people who you think would be interested in solar. Uh, that's uh, that's a powerful resource to use, and maybe ask some people that are specialized in LinkedIn as far as looking for people who are interested in in, uh, in solar, like homeowners and stuff like that. Okay, uh, blog articles, use those, post them on LinkedIn as well which is leads us to our next little piece here, the blogging platform. All right, this is really powerful in your marketing system. If you're a plus or a pro member, you're going to have a blogging platform. So if you go over to my marketing pages and go to my blog, you guys can create blog articles here. Now, before you go just trying to do that and shoot in the dark, go over to resources and training, go to system training or sorry about that. Go to resources and training, go to SEO training and watch these videos here. You got to click the view content button and watch it. What is SEO? Keyword research, creating your first blog post, doing YouTube. Watch this training or these training videos and you guys will be able to actually go effectively blog, work on getting your pages ranked and doing the right things. So when people start searching for solar in your area, you can potentially come up. And those articles you guys can share on Facebook, right? Those are the kind of things people want to read. So that's another good one. And then paid traffic, Facebook and Google ads. Guys, you absolutely can run Facebook ads and Google ads here. Um, we're going to do a separate training on this. So by the time you're watching this, this video, we may have already done that. Um, but running a Facebook ad and whatnot, it's huge. One thing I'll touch on is in your marketing system. If you guys know what the Facebook pixel is, listen up to this. If you don't, don't worry about it right now. But if you go to configure site and you go to my social links, you can pop your Facebook pixel ID in here. That way all your pages will be pixeled. So your, your capture pages will be retargeting. Your tour pages will be showing conversions. Once again, if you don't, that went over your head, don't worry about it. We're going to do a separate training on that. But you guys can absolutely go into Facebook, fire up your ads manager, all right, and create an ad. You guys can build a, um, you guys can build a, uh, Facebook page and then boost posts that way in your local area. All right, another really good thing to do. So with that being said, guys, primarily this one right here, okay? And uh, well, I wanted to highlight that, but you get what I'm trying to do here. Um, let me go here, that one right there. And this one, which carries down into here, big. Big, big, big. I mean, you could literally work this over and over and over again and use this, this system and be consistent with it. This one's big. This one is, is, uh, is big after you get some training on it, which we're going to show you guys. Um, and with that being said, go out there, generate interest and get some people and some eyeballs on your stuff because it's going to uh, work out big time for you and stay consistent with it. Don't get discouraged. Put a Facebook post up, no one comments. Work a little bit of a different angle on the next one. And if you really need to, which is powerful, go click on this home tab and go like and comment on a lot of, a lot of other people's stuff. When you do that, like look, my, this is a perfect example. My post just popped up from June 6th. Why? Because people are commenting on it, all right? And then I'm going and responding, but I'm giving it some time. Like if someone, like for example, Brad, my buddy commented, I'm not gonna go respond back to this until tonight. Him commenting threw this back into the Facebook news feed and now when I comment later tonight, it's gonna to throw it back in again. So for me to comment right now, Facebook's already popping it up because of him. I'm gonna wait and I'm gonna pop my comment in later tonight so it pops it back in again and it keeps working the system. So one, that's a little tidbit. I just went off on a tangent there, but it's important. And then two, go through and like and comment on other people's stuff. When you show other people support, they tend to show you support back. So. With that being said, hopefully that helps you guys out. Hopefully that helps you generate interest and give you some direction. This training video, I mean, you guys could run a long ways with the stuff you just learned. So that being said, get it done, share it with your team, make it happen. 
And uh, if you guys haven't set, signed up for your affiliate program yet for Run With Solar, if you do plan on sharing this system out, be sure to go do that as well. If you just go into my marketing pages, go to my links right here. If you copy and paste this link, you guys can sign up for an affiliate program and share this thing out. Because once you start seeing results, you're going to want to share it with um, you know other team members and whatnot. So with that being said, appreciate you all. We'll talk to you in a bit. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.